Hey, this is Anthony Frizzolo. Watch, decide, and ride. Welcome to our 2017 Motorcycle Riding Jeans Gear Guide at Revzilla.com. In this video, we're going to cover the top six, the top six riding jeans for 2017. So whether you're looking at covert protection or you're looking to be a little bit more aggressive and technical, these are the best picks for riding jeans before you get into full on motorcycle pants. And again, in our opinion, they typically cover you three to four season, depending on your temperature tolerances. And today we're going to cover six across a multitude of styles, applications, and certainly price points. Now, keep in mind, this is part of our larger gear guide series, helmets, jackets, boots, gloves, Loves 2017 C17 guides from Revzilla.com slash guides, where we curate the best of the key categories in the motorcycle universe. Now, moving into our first jean for 2017, the Juggernaut. To our left is the Scorpion Covert Pro at $160. In our opinion, value for dollar, protection for dollar, and versatility, this is the best jean under the $200 mark. You're looking at a jean that's 14 ounce Cordura denim with 60% coverage in Kevlar behind the scenes. Very solid coverage, and it will also take Sastec armor that you can add later. Now, keep in mind, quick note on fitment. This is what we consider more of a Levi's 569 cut. So it's gonna be a loose straight leg. It's gonna look great for sport riding, sport commuting, everyday touring. Again, if it fits you, it should carry a classic style with it. Hive is Brian, six foot 195. He typically wears a 33 waist, 32 inch jean in his normal Levi's. Here in the Scorpion Covert Pros, he's a 34 inch waist that are also covering his 32 inch inseam. And for frame of reference, he's about a 35 and a half belly button waist if you're using the more pronounced size chart. So again, if we look at the jean itself, notice the contrast stitching, five pocket design, turn back for, for me there, HVB. If we look at the back, very clean. You're gonna have Kevlar that goes down the back of the leg. And if we look at the pockets, no surprises there either. This is what I would consider a classic American cut riding jean. And before we forget, down at the right cuff, you see how we have it flipped, slip liner at the bottom, but most importantly, there's gonna be a pop of reflectivity. If you turn it up and you're riding at night, you can have a better chance of being seen. Come back around to the front. So remember, this is the Scorpion Covert Pro at 160 bucks, the best bang for the buck riding jean that's fully featured under $200. You can also keep in mind for about 135, you can go with the Scorpion regular covert jean, which gives you Kevlar reinforcement, but it's not as heavy. Moving from everyday protection, now we get that much more sophisticated. New for the spring of 17, this is the Revit Alpha Chino. And in our estimation, the Alpha Chino. Hua! No, it's an Alpha Chino, is the best executed Chino that we've seen done in moto in quite some time, actually, if ever. A lot have tried, Revit finally got it right. Coming in at around the $200 mark, we have a black, there's also going to be a camel color, but if we really look at it, C-smart, CE-rated armor in the knees, the fit and finish are absolutely tremendous, and if we want something that's gonna be sophisticated on the bike, off the bike, if you can't wear jeans to the office, you could totally rock this, this is your bet. Now, Hive is Brian, you know him to my left, remember, 33 inch jeans waist, 32 inch inseam, 35 and a half at the belly button. He's wearing a size 34 in the Revit Alpha Chino. It is hemmable, but you can see even the way it stacks with that 34 and of around a 32 inch inseam. Keep that in mind, it's going to be more of a Levi's 511 cut, which we consider to be much more tapered and slim fit, but it really, really works with this style. And that's one of the reasons why we believe they've gotten it right. Now, diving back into some of the other feature set, again, triple stitching in any of the exposed seams that are gonna be more accident prone. If we turn him backwards really briefly, you're gonna see the backside is classic and refined. And you also see that on his right cuff, we have it flipped up, there's a pop of reflective on the lateral side. Come back around to the front. The last thing I neglected to mention, is that while it is a 14 ounce Cordura denim with a twill finish here in this Chino, it's also going to have Revit Power Shield, which backs it. It's like their version of Kevlar, but it's not Kevlar. It actually breathes a little bit better, and you're gonna get that in the hips, in the seat, in the knees. Again, the additional refinement that's gonna allow for further slideability if you happen to go down. Again, the best sophisticated Chino on the market for 2017. This is the Revit Alpha Chino. Hoo-ah. 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 <laughs> that was a good one. 
Next up is our best mid-range technical riding jean for 17. This is our Bullet SR6. But before we dive into the weeds and tell you why, keep in mind, we're gonna ship free over 39 bucks with everything I'm showing you today is. And as always, click our logo, subscribe to Sir Revzilla on our YouTube channel, leave me your comments, your questions, your feedback. More importantly, tell us what we left out, challenge us, tell us what you think we got wrong. Now, diving back into our SR6. We've known Bullet for the last few years. They're out of the UK, and in 17, all of their new jeans are getting an overhaul in fit, finish, and styling, and that's really why it makes the cut. So around the $200 mark for this SR6, you're looking at a jean. This is gonna be the Cafe, which is a raw blue, which really has a classic five pocket design. We'll take an optional CE Level 2 StarTech armor, which you can buy separately, but the big call out with Bullet that's different than many of the other technical riding jeans in the market is the fact they use a material called Kovac to reinforce your denim. So 60% coverage behind the scenes in Kovac, which breathes a little bit better, will still give you six seconds of slide holds up better and rides cooler than Kevlar from a detergent proof sweat proof aspect from an abrasion or flexibility proof again it's an alternative material you can see it called out here right at the top which really uses different tech to achieve the same results but some guys absolutely swear by it now keep in mind the fitment here of your bullet sr6 this is going to be our straight fit. And again, there's an easy fit, which is relaxed. There's also a slim fit, and this jean comes in five different colors. But to my left, Hive is Brian is wearing the straight fit. That's more of a Levi's 501 cut. Keep in mind, Brian is about a 33 inch jeans waist, and he's a 32 inch inseam. He's wearing a size 34, and you can see how it sits. It's that classic straight leg Levi's 501 cut. Now, Hive is Brian, turn backwards for me. Let's give a quick shot of the back. A little bit more aggressive with your bullet logo here on the back pocket. Pockets. Again, you can see the rise is a little bit more full. Double belt loop here in the back. And you can see, again, remember that you're gonna have Kovac coverage nearly 60% all the way down. And the other nice part about it, come back around to the front here, HVB, is that you're getting a full mesh slip liner, which allows ease of entry and exit into this pant. Again, it's just gonna be that much more comfortable, giving you a little bit of breathing room. So again, we think about technical mid-range at the $200 mark using alternative materials, but producing great results. We love the Bullet SR6 in 2017. Next up, we throw it back to Italy. This is our classic premium, aggressive Italian option. And when I say premium, we're now coming in north of $250 with an extremely technical jean from Dionese. This is the Charger, and we absolutely love it. In yesteryear, if you're a diehard Dionese fan, we saw the D1, which was very technical straight leg, almost had more of a taper. The new Dionese Charger steals DNA from it, but improves upon it. And why we love it so much is that if we look at this blacked out jean, it's actually 12 ounce with Kevlar infusion without getting yellowed. You're also going to get Kevlar in the seat, but our favorite thing is that adjustability in the Kit J knee armor, which is included in this pant, gives you phenomenal coverage for your knee as well as your shin. Now, quickly, from a Dionese fit scheme, if we look at this, this is gonna be more of your straight leg. It's a Levi's 541 fit, which doesn't have a taper, is a little bit more European, but again, carries that great style aggression and finish. Hive is Brian to my left. Remember, six foot 195, 33 inch jeans waist. He's wearing a size 33. And for frame of reference, his belly button is about a 35 and a half. You can also see that it kind of is the right fit for him from an inseam standpoint. He's about a 32. You see that we cuffed it down along the right. We have it cuffed up to show that it's not yellow. Even though it's Kevlar infused, it's not going to be yellow on the inside. But I will call out there's no reflective on this jean either. So again, keep that in mind when you're thinking about the fit scheme. Other things to keep in mind, it's a four pocket design. Hive is Brian, turn face backwards for me. You can see a little bit of Euro stylish in the pockets here with a little bit of accent stitching, a little bit of mid entry versus top down. Again, reinforced belt loops as they go all the way around and you can see as they come down the back here. Again, straight leg, it hugs him a little bit more with his athletic build. It's not gonna be loose and baggy, but that's why you're signing up for Dionese. Come back around to the front. But the thing that really sets it apart, again, is going to be that removable Kit J armor that comes stock now at $260. $60 that you used to have to spend about $80 to upgrade on the previous iterations of this jean. So again, we love the Charger for 2017 based on all of the refinements they've made. 
Staying with our technical theme, now we move 180 degrees from Italy and we move into Climb. This is a premium technical gene from Climb called the K51. And in our opinion, it's one of the best technical, relaxed fitting, more American cut jeans within motorcycling. It also happens to come in just under the $300 mark. We lovingly call it the Brett Favre of motorcycle jeans. It's mature, it's technical, and it fits like a Wrangler. No joke, let's dive right into the fit here on this Cordura denim. If we look at it, it is relaxed, it is loose, it is meant for an audience that is not looking for a European cut, and the fit scheme is meant to be a bit more comfortable. Keep that in mind. We have Hivis Brian to my left. Remember, 33 inch jeans waist, he's wearing a size 34, and you can even see how that works down and breaks with his inseam. Now, if we dive back into some of the technical features here, one of the other things we love about this jean, why it is so technical, Cordura denim included adjustable D3 Evo armor in the knees. That is a molecular armor. In the hips, you also get D3 and also in the tailbone, you're getting Poron XRD, which is a dense molecular foam, giving yourself the ability to protect your tailbone if you happen to go down. Now turn backwards for me there, HVB. You can see it. It is that classic American cut. It's a bit more of your dad's jeans, and that's totally fine because it owns that niche within the market. Basic pockets along the back. I actually dig the way they lay the pockets out, and you see it's this classic blue. There are a few colors available here in the K51 from Climb. Again, very unassuming, like Brett Favre, but technical enough to win the Super Bowl. That's what we dig about. A cup. Come back around to the front for me. Show you a couple more things here. Other things to keep in mind, it's a five pocket design. You have rubberized buttons. It's a zippered fly and you're going to have rubberized rivets too. So nothing's going to get in the way or scratch your bike. Again, the best in this mature category being very technical for 2017. This is the K51 from Climb. And last up in our riding jeans guide is our Rocker Tech. Straight out of Switzerland. Yes, it's nosebleed, it's expensive, but it's extremely technical. This is our favorite super premium European jean, and it comes in around the $500 mark. Now, if we look at it, the beauty of it is it just looks like a premium fashion inspired jean, but that's what Rocker does. They beef up the protection without sacrificing any of the premium nature of the denim itself or of the styling or the look. Now, the Rocker Tech's brand new for 17, and I'm gonna call it the odd bird in the Rocker lineup, but I'm saying, odd bird with love because if we look at it remember there's no internal double layer all the other rocker jeans are going to have that internal dynatech double layer that gives you its 11 seconds of slide the rocker tech however is different by way of making the outer material the denim reinforced with armolith and it actually bakes in that slide protection between four and six seconds and it's a little bit more breathable in a single layer now we're going to talk a little bit more about that but let's briefly talk about sizing hive is brian last up to my left six foot 195 42 inch chest 33 inch jeans waist he's wearing a size 34 from rocker here in the rocker tech and you can see it's a 34 waist it's gonna have a 32 inch inseam and remember there's two cuts on this jean this is the slim straight which is going to be straight leg but a little bit more narrow there's also the slim which comes in two colors a black and a blue which would be more stonewashed again so you have your pick again a little bit of elasticity but that's moved back to the armolith for a second the beauty of how they give you that slide ability is you're taking ultra high weight molecular polyethylene and what you're doing is you're wrapping cotton around that the premium denim so what you see is a jean it just looks like a jean, but the guts of the fibers of this denim are going to have that high tensile strength and abrasion resistance, allowing you to slide four plus seconds. And the cool part about it too, is you sacrifice nothing by way of comfort. If you look down along the cuff, you're going to see that it just looks like a normal single layer jean. Now, how does Brian turn backwards? A few more things to call out. There are pockets for D3O armor at the knee and at the hip. They, the D3O armor doesn't come standard, but my other thing that I love about the new 17 collection of Rocker is they've toned down the pockets. The previous rocker pockets were big with big flames. Now they're subtle, they're low profile. They will work much better for the American market. And again, if we look at this jean, it is gonna be that slim straight cut, premium European denim. It will breathe better, it will be more comfortable and you'll still get that slide. Again, keep in mind, come back around to the front, that if you wanna beef things up, you still have the full collection of 11 second slide from rocker around the same price point, which give you that secondary leather or layer of the Dynatech on the inside. Now again, this is the Rocker Tech though. Now, keep in mind the next step in your journey is to click the info button, shop the full collection and watch detailed breakdown videos on every jean I've shown you today as part of our 2017 Motorcycle Riding Jean Gear Guide. It's also part of our larger guide series, revzilla.com slash guides, helmets, jackets, boots, gloves, 17 guides for 2017 where we curate the best of the industry, whether you're just starting out or you're looking to upgrade your gear. Keep in mind, you 
you can always contact us, see us at RevZilla.com or 877 792 9455 if you need help. And don't forget to subscribe to us on YouTube at RevZilla. Thanks for watching our 2017 Motorcycle Riding Jeans Gear Guide at RevZilla. I'm Anthony. We'll see you next time.